ice cream. And I love summertime. Oh, why, why, nothing's better in the summertime than delicious ice cream. But lately, it's been so hot outside because it's summer that my ice cream's been getting the melts. Well, I, just this morning I was at the park trying to eat my ice cream and it got the melts really bad. Well, let me see if I can tell you the tale. Let's see, with something like this. Ah, summertime and ice cream. It's my favorite time. Hey, hey, what, what's happening down there, everybody? It's me, Mr. Sun, here to brighten your day. Oh, oh, hey, Mr. Sun. It's Mr. Sun. Yes, sir. It's summertime. It's time for sunny summertime and hot. You think maybe you can make it so that it's not quite so hot so my ice cream doesn't get the melts? Well, that's sort of my job, is to make it hot. I mean... I'm not asking you for a big favor, just so that my ice cream doesn't get melted. You melted my ice cream! Maybe if you don't like it, you can you can go inside into the air conditioning. You're such a jerk, Mr. Sun! One of my favorite things to do is melt ice cream. Let me just take a look at that for you there. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, melt, <laughs> melt. <laughs> now, oh, I have melted this stupid... Mr. Sun! Oh, oh, don't be such a baby. You're such a crybaby. Oh, boo. <laughs> that was terrible, guys. Uh, oh, my ice cream's been melting. If only there was a way that I could replace my ice cream when it gets the melts. Oh, well, now I can with Crazy Art's 2-in-1 Ice Cream Maker. That's right. With the Crazy Art 2-in-1 Ice Cream Maker, I can make all the delicious ice cream I want whenever my ice cream gets the melt. Anyway, are you guys ready to open up the Crazy Art 2-in-1 Ice Cream Maker and see what's inside and start making delicious ice cream? Me too. Let's do it. Here it is, the ice cream maker, all set up and ready to make ice cream. But now we gotta pick the kind of ice cream that we want. Do we want chocolate ice cream, strawberry ice cream, or vanilla ice cream? So let's get rid of vanilla and make chocolate and strawberry. So you need your two bowls and your flavor mixes. So we're gonna take the chocolate flavor mix and we're gonna pour it into the first bowl. So you can pour it all in there. Oh, it smells delicious. And then you need your strawberry mix for the second bowl, which is over here. And you pour all your strawberry mix in there. Oh, you can't see that because it's not, it, I thought it was gonna be red, but it's not, it's very clear. Very clear. Now this is something that you need that doesn't come with your ice cream machine. It's called half and half. I don't know what that means. It's half something and half something else. You gotta pour your half and half into your bowls and then mix it up so that you can get your ice cream mixed together. So you need this measuring cup. It says one third cup. So you're gonna put one third of a cup of half and half into the cup and then you're gonna pour it into the chocolate mix and then you're gonna pour another one third of the cup into your strawberry mix. Now you have to mix it. There's the chocolate milk. Now I gotta mix the strawberry milk. Ooh, the strawberry milk. Is, now it's starting to get red and strawberry-y. Perfect! We have chocolate and strawberry mix now. Then you've gotta open the top of your ice cream maker and you've got a tray. And on one side of the tray, you gotta pour all of your chocolate mix. And get it all inside, nice and good. And then on the other side of your tray, you gotta pour in all your strawberry mix. Oh, yummy, yum, yum. So now, you're also gonna need a bag of ice and some salt. You're gonna put the ice and the salt in this drum, and then you're gonna put the drum on top of the chocolate and vanilla, and you're gonna mix it up. So the first thing you gotta do is take off the drum lids. Then, you gotta fill them up with ice. Uh-oh. Then you need five spoons of salt. Five. Then you gotta add some cold water to fill it up to the top. Then you gotta put your lids back on and you gotta make sure there's a rubber seal in there that the seal's on so the water doesn't come out. Then at the very bottom, you gotta lock these together so that they make one super drum. Now you've gotta take your drum and lock it into place inside of the machine and close the lid back up so you can start cranking the handle. You gotta crank the handle for 10 minutes. 10 whole minutes is a long time to crank a handle, but it's worth it for delicious ice cream. 
Look guys, look at the ice cream starting to come. It's starting to form in the in the machine because it's so cold and you're mixing it up. And then make sure you put your little tray in the front while you're cranking the handle so it'll catch all the ice cream as it comes down. Look guys, at some point, you're actually gonna get ice cream out of there. Look at it, look at the ice cream. It takes a long time. It actually takes longer than 10 minutes. I sort of cheated. You could put it in the freezer for a little bit to help it along because it's gotta get super cold to get it. Ooh, now I can scoop it out into the tray. So to get it out into the tray, you gotta push this and watch it come down the, coming down the slide. Coming down the ice cream slide. Mm -hmm. Right into the ice cream ball. Oh, here's some chocolate for you. Would you like some chocolate or some strawberry? Delicious! Ah, here it is! My delicious strawberry and chocolate ice cream! Ready to eat! What the heck just happened to my delicious chocolate and strawberry ice cream? This is regular ice cream. You can make a vanilla ice cream. Well, guys, it looks like ice cream's not meant to be for me this summer. Anyway, if you guys like ice cream videos, why not check out Dr. Dreadful's Zombie Hand? It's a zombie hand made of ice cream and popsicles and stuff. Or why not check out the Dippin' Dots video? Yay, Dippin' Dots! Anyway, thanks for watching all the videos, guys. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and like the video, and tell all your friends about the videos. And I love you guys, and I love ice cream. And I'll talk to you guys soon. And I love you guys. Thanks, guys. Bye.